Iranian climber El Nazra Kabi was met with cheers and applause on Wednesday while making her first public appearance since her competition in South Korea. A crowd had awaited her arrival at a Tehran airport. With many cheering, El Naz is a heroine. That's despite Rakabi reiterating to state media that she didn't mean to compete without a hijab. As I explained in my social media stories, this situation happened entirely accidentally. And I think the story that I posted about it on social media fully explained it. The struggle I had with my shoes and preparing my gear made me forget about the proper hijab that I should have been wearing. And I went to the wall and ascended. Many believed she was supporting protests back home, ignited by Masa Amini's death. Amini died after being arrested by morality police for, quote, inappropriate attire, setting off unprecedented nationwide protests where women removed and burned headscarves. BBC Persian reported that friends had been unable to reach Rakabi after her competition, spurring fears about her safety. But in her televised comments, Rakabi denied being unreachable and said she returned to Iran as planned. The International Olympic Committee said it had talked to the athlete and had received assurances from Iran's National Olympic Committee that she would not face consequences. I have returned to Iran in full health and I apologize to the Iranian people for the turmoil and worry that I created for them. Rakabi says she has no plans to quit the national team.